Hey coin collectors. Welcome back to Coin Oz. In this episode we are going to display 8 US coins that are highly sought after among collectors and command strong premiums at coin auctions. So without further ado, let's get to it. Subscribe. Number 8. 1983 D. Roosevelt Dime. Graded in Mint State 67 FB by PCGS. FB standing for full bands. According to the NGC price guide, as of November 2023, a Roosevelt dime from 1983 in circulated condition is worth between 15 cents and 35 cents. However, on the open market 1983D dimes in pristine, uncirculated condition sell for as much as $300. But this MS67 gem with full bands was sold for $1,968.75 with buyer's fee. Number 7. 1985 Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 68 plus red by PCGS. This magnificent 1985 Lincoln Cent is one of the 12 coins certified in this lofty grade at PCGS, with just single finer. The design elements exhibit razor sharp definition and the pristine original red surfaces radiate vibrant mint luster on both sides. It was sold for $3,475.12 with buyer's fee. Number 6. Attractively toned 1962 D. Washington Quarter. Graded in Mint State 67 Plus by PCGS. Pinkish, olive green, cerulean blue shades grace the obverse surfaces of this quarter dollar. According to David Hall, though the mintage is huge, over 100 million coins, this is one of the scarcer 1941 to 1964 silver Washington quarters in gem condition. There weren't that many saved at the time of issue, and most uncirculated survivors have lots of marks and abrasions. This spectacular gem fetched a sum of $5,140.12. Number 5. 1929D Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 66 Plus Red by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, exceptionally well produced for an issue that is known for the widespread use of worn dyes, this premium quality gem is sharply defined throughout. Satiny and smooth. The surfaces are of further desirability given the full pinkish rose luster that the coin retains. Although mint state survivors of this high mintage issue are plentiful in an absolute sense, most are confined to lower grades due to poor striking quality, subdued luster or numerous detracting blemishes. This example was sold for $7,800. Number 4. 1942 D. Jefferson Nickel. Highly sought after repunched mint mark variety, D over horizontal D. Graded in Mint State 65 by PCGS. This well-struck gem boasts a lovely champagne rose luster. A very nice piece, and among the finest certified for an issue that is rare even in lower Mint State grades. Important find for the advanced Jefferson Nickel collector. It was sold for $8,050. Number 3. 1914 Lincoln Cent. Graded as PR67 plus Brown by NGC. As of November 2023, this is the sole finest 1914 Matt Proof Lincoln in the BN category graded by either PCGS or NGC. It is no surprise that at this lofty state of preservation, this superb gem is flawless. Satiny lustrous matte finish surfaces are brilliant and highlight the deep chocolate brown. As you rotate this beauty in a light, the fine facets of the sandblast finish sparkle and accent hints of steely blue overtones. Every detail is razor sharp. If you seek an exemplar matte proof scent, this is as high a grade as they come. It ended up selling for $8,400. Number 2. 1953 Carver, Washington Commemorative Half Dollar. Graded in Mint State 67 by NGC. This half dollar exhibits unsurpassable quality, mark-free, glowing lustrous surfaces with some attractive iridescent reddish gold color over the obverse. Sharply struck with no blemishes of any kind, some mint-made dye lines are noted in the reverse field. It ended up selling for $9,987.50. Number 1. 1921s Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 65 Re by PCGS. Delightful golden orange surfaces are fully lustrous with a much shaper strike than typically encountered for the issue. A relatively limited mintage of 15,274,000 pieces has made the 1921S a popular Lincoln scent with collectors since the year of issue. Though Lincoln scent specialists are well aware, the casual bidder would be surprised by the relative dearth of gem red examples of the 1921S in today's market. 
This is a better produced, better preserved example and it ended up selling for $26,400. Thanks for watching this video. Consider subscribing to our channel for more captivating numismatic content. Have a good one.